Hey everyone, it's Brent here from Aswell's Armoury and today we've got another custom build for a customer. This is a, what we call, so this is the Aztec Innovation Chimera MK47. So it's a cross between an, an AK front end and an AR15 rear. So this has our split Magnatech gearbox with just a standard trigger. Uh, it's got the Leviathan MOSFET in there as well as brushless motor. Uh, it, this one is sporting 16 to 1 SHS gears. It's running the Apache, our Aztec Innovations T-piece, stainless steel barrel. It's running our Hellfire at the end there, uh, as well as uh, anti-reverse, our hybrid anti-reverse latch, which just is, is far more reliable than a lot of other builds. It's running a drop stock with uh, a nice little compact stock at the back here. So this is one that was developed specifically for a customer. And the reason why, obviously for the AK front end, it's got, it houses about 300, 320 gels in the magazine. So it's a hell of a lot better than just a standard M4. And some people love that banana look, banana mag look. But uh, you can see also with the, with the Leviathan MOSFET, just this trigger response is and of course it gives you, running a Jeftron Leviathan MOSFET gives you that ability to really customize your firing mode. So, you know, in the middle position, so this has got a 90 degree uh, instead of full 180 degree that comes with the Chimera. So you've got what normally would be your uh, safe, semi and full auto. We've got it as binary mode there, semi and full auto. So on this one, we didn't go for a really high rate or the customer didn't want a really high rate of fire. So that's why it is a bit slower than normal, but uh, just for that, we call this like your, tom your standard tomati build, which is, uh, goes back a long way, but it's still stuck. So without further ado though, we'll uh, do some chrono reading. So you can see there, it's just around that 320 to 330 mark. And then I'll just put some full auto in there. And again, you know, it's 320, 330 kind of mark as well. So at around that 18 to 20 rounds per second, which is exactly what the customer wanted. Not a high rate of fire, he doesn't want to empty, even though it comes with 300, 300 uh, round capacity, he didn't want to empty the mag in, in no time. But it's one hell of a reliable build, that's for sure, and high power. So the customer is going to be very, very happy with this one. Uh, thanks again, guys. Remember to subscribe to our channel and like the video, and uh, we'll see you again next time. Thanks.